But firstly, we're going to be speaking to broadcaster Keith Walsh coming up to eight o'clock this morning uh, on, on life as a sober person in Ireland, someone who doesn't drink. And it got us thinking this morning, is there still a stigma, do you think, Jonathan, around being a non-drinker in Ireland? Absolutely. Every time that you go out and choose not to drink, you end up in social environments where other people are drinking around you and there is a sense that there's something wrong with you if you're not drinking. I Look, I take a pint. I know you take a pint. Um, it is something that is normalised in this country. And when you don't take alcoholic drink, sometimes when you're out, you do feel under pressure. Now, I'd imagine it's less so if you ne- if you don't drink at all and you've never done it. Uh, but for those who have been known to take a pint, people look at you sideways as if there's something wrong with you that you don't actually consume alcohol. What I do think is happening, though, Kira, is there's a bit of a sea change intergenerationally because it would appear now the younger generation coming through are not following our example. And there are plenty of... Uh, reports out there that younger people are just turning their back on the alcoholic culture that their parents have just assumed is normal. Yeah, I, I, I do, we both of us take a drink. In fact, occasionally we've taken them together. But I, I think we have up until now viewed non-drinkers with a great deal of suspicion in mm. Ireland. I think suspicion is the right word. We're wary of them. And indeed, the only people you ever hear called an alcoholic in Ireland is the people who are sober, who say they're an alcoholic and have stopped drinking. The people who are stocious at the bar, we'd never call them alcoholics. We literally call non-drinkers alcoholics with, with, with gusto, but nobody else. I agree with you. I think it's changing. I think I think not so much even health consciousness, but maybe body consciousness among younger people has changed their interaction with alcohol and, and very possibly in a good way. And I recall myself when I was pregnant, being outed as a pregnant woman multiple times by random strangers practically because if you didn't drink in Ireland as a woman people would literally say are you on antibiotics? Are you pregnant? And you'd be like oh my god shut up 